Congratulations, you're one of the first 10 players to start. Bounce, bounce, planet. To thank you for your support, we're sending you two tickets to Planet Lab's Cloud Island. We're inviting you to experience a holographic adventure based on our other games. Please enjoy this and immerse yourself in different roles from various worlds and embark on a fantastical treasure hunt. Winter's emissaries, please work together to find the treasure! 
May you banish winter's chilling might and bring us warm. The last time I saw that expression was when we fed a stray dog together. I believe in you, Winter's Emissaries! This howling winter won't be a problem so long as we have that legendary treasure! Excuse me, are you referring to us when you say winter's emissaries? The legends speak of those who have halos atop their heads! Winter's emissaries! And only Winter's Emissaries can find the treasure that brings warmth to wintry days. So, you've got the snow on, boys! I believe you can bring warmth to our town and help everyone survive this winter! It seems he still has more to say. Are you cold? Use this. Walking with your eyes glued to a phone screen is dangerous. You might get lost before the adventure even begins. Indeed. I also happen to be thinking the same thing. The staff gave them to me and requested our outfits be somewhat consistent. Players, please put on your halos. Make your way to the preparation zone by following the signs. See? It's not. However, I believe that it's ideal for us to share the burden when light pollution like this is involved. We used real snow and ice to create the scenery, so watch your step and try not to slip. Cabins with a blue sign are safe spots within the area. They serve as shelters during emergencies. You can also rest there. If you're ready, please follow me through this door and close your eyes. Once you hear a voice, 
Open your eyes. That's when the game will start. Your roles and objectives will be revealed after. Since we don't exactly know what's waiting for us, it's best to stick close to your navigator. Isn't that the city builder game you recommended to me? The houses next to the plaza do look similar to the ones in game. It's over there. Opening up a game before my daily morning run is a simple matter. It's possible the designers used Evol to make this. The Halo acts as a pass of sorts. I know what's on your mind. I asked a few villagers. If we reach the forest that's halfway up the mountain, the solution will take us directly to the summit. That's because someone was too busy admiring the snails and the bushes. Unfortunately, the snails are currently hibernating and thus cannot answer your questions. Or what? Your accusation is unfair. I went for a run yesterday morning. 
I bought you coffee on my way back as well. Did you forget? You're right. When the weather is this cold, it's necessary to find an effective method for staying warm. I feel warmer now. You saved my life again. <sighs> I don't have a quest for that. If anything, I only have myself to blame for wearing these shoes. When I bought them, I didn't expect the soles to be so prone to slipping. It's too late. I already saw it. Really? So there's no underlying meaning behind your laughter? In the movies we've watched together, there's typically a scene where one character carries another in these situations. You don't need to use me to test the principle of levers. All you have to do is lend me a hand, Miss Physicist. I was concerned I'd only be a hindrance to you, but now I think it's better to ask for your assistance. You'll help me, right? Please. The mountain path is slippery. Be careful. I'm certain you'll still be energetic 50 years from now. There will be a blizzard soon. After doing research in the Arctic for several years, I managed to pick up some skills.
plus some lessons learned from my own recklessness. Let's rest at the safe spot for now. Once the blizzard ends, we can continue our quest. It's probably to enhance the player's immersion. Otherwise, one could just stroll into the ice palace and grab the treasure without any difficulty. You shouldn't be that close. A blizzard can destroy the window. Sit by the fireplace. It'll keep you warm. If you knew what my actual goal was, then why did you still move? I'm honored to be your personal heater after serving as your navigator. Treasure that brings warmth in winter. The concept is similar enough. Perhaps the treasure is a self heating energy stone. Winter's emissaries are like torch bearers. They've been entrusted with the responsibility of bringing energy to the village. Then what sort of fantasy would you like to listen to? At the time, my parents and I went to your place for dinner. Then it suddenly started snowing. It was getting late, and our car wouldn't start. We had no choice but to spend the night there. However, you had already returned to your room. We barely talked that day. You're awake? Here. 
I just finished brewing some tea. This weather is but a simulation. Can't keep players trapped for too long. <laughs> it's nothing. I was thinking that... This blizzard may have heard the wishes of Winter's emissaries. They wanted to stay together, so it appeared. I don't have anything interesting to tell you. I rarely saw snow falling when I was a student. I devoted most of my time to reading. I got so focused on books that I often missed the snow falling by the time I got out of the library. As far as I can remember, the snow I saw was more on the ground than in the air. No, I didn't, but now I have one. The way forward is blocked. It will be difficult to figure out where we're going. During my time in the Arctic, I learned of a local idiom. Snow will show the way. However, it's hard to judge its authenticity. I haven't tested it either. It could be nothing more than a saying. I have doubts about whether or not this will work. The what if you proposed is more uncertain than the idea itself. Yes. It seems that I'm not the only one whose eyes are open.
OK。May the snow be our guide and show us the path ahead. What we seek is a sign that will lead us to the forest. We don't need to take turns to do this sort of thing. I didn't say I had no faith. Otherwise, I wouldn't have said those words in the first place. Since we're already in a game, we should be more serious about it. Thank you for the compliment. I got it from the novel you left at my house. A downhill path shouldn't be too difficult to traverse. Someone's motorcycle skills left quite the impression. I hope the sled ride is a smoother experience. I wasn't implying anything.
Could you explain what driver-friendly mode offers? <laughs> it seems to be also passenger-friendly. I had a feeling this experience would be unforgettable, too. I'm just fulfilling my duties as Zane, the personal heater. Someone cares for me, so I don't feel cold. As I've said before, if we reach the forest that's halfway up the mountain, the solution will take us directly to the summit. The villagers' hint might not be as literal as it sounds. In the worst case scenario, we can keep climbing up the mountain. Every challenge has multiple solutions. Hello, Winter's Emissaries. I am Solution. I can take you to the summit, thanks to my constitution. Please be gentle with me. Patting my head will fill my heart with glee. My master lives below the mountain in a village small. If you're mean to me, I'll tell them, and it won't be a nice fall. The wordplay was unexpected.
Honestly speaking, I believe it hasn't been a secret for a while now. They appear to be observation notes written by Winter's emissaries over the years. This one says, Foggy, no sun in sight. The weather has been cloudy this whole time. If it were truly effective, we wouldn't have a mess of parchment to deal with. At the very least, ensuring others succeed doesn't mean we completely failed. If we're talking about a certain kind of sun, there's one right in front of me. She's warmer than the sun in the sky, irreplaceable until the end of time. Or 
or perhaps we've already found the treasure. Yes, the sun might be referring to us. I suppose the real hints are mixed in with some fake ones. I underestimated this game's difficulty. I recall the Bridge of Snowflakes over there being a gift from you. However, I believe it was just so you could clean up your inventory. It's a hot spring, and relaxing in one can certainly ward off winter's chill. You're very humble for a gaming master. In order to be of greater help in the future, I need lessons from such a talented individual. Is this enough to prove my devotion? If that is your wish, then snow will fall just for you, even in the middle of summer. With Winter's emissary by your side, every snowflake will remember your name. As well as our story.
Thank <laughs> you.